it's Amber and to introduce this video um, it's gonna be a bit of a vlog that's a little bit chaotic because I had originally filmed all of this on my Instagram stories and I was just so excited and I was filming all of it and I was like you know what I really also want to do a YouTube video with this but I don't have enough storage on my phone camera so like I can just download the stories it's fine I'll figure it out and doing so was such a hassle but I figured it out just for the purpose of doing this vlog for you guys because I was so excited that this Halloween store was finally open I had been waiting since Friday to go in and on my way to work I saw that it was open and I'm like I'm going in and it had been open since I think this weekend last weekend sorry um, and already a lot of things were gone um, but thankfully there was still a lot of cool stuff and I just really wanted to document it for you guys and so here it is guys it's open I'm going in So we're a weird commercial to be playing right now in here. Oh, look how cute! Why do I need this? Oh my goodness, like, I kind of need this. <laughs> Alright, I guess that's appropriate. How cute are these? Oh my god. it's amber from the future here editing this video and this is around the time when the music really started to get really loud and i didn't want to get copyrighted so i'm just gonna narrate from here what was happening what i was doing what i was seeing obviously you guys can see what i was seeing um so yeah here i was just browsing the aisles looking at all the costumes i just was looking at all the cute like kids costumes that I wish were in my size so I could just own and have just even as a wardrobe must like there was Harry Potter dresses I think in one aisle and there was um a Wednesday dress like I just I wanted those just to wear as everyday outfits not even this Halloween so I was super happy to see like all these cute little um costumes for kids that there was so much things for them to choose from but I was a little bummed out that like there wasn't anything really in my size when it came to those things but it's okay um I just love seeing the costumes and things like tumblers and water bottles and mugs and stickers and keychains and all that stuff there were a few like little not little like medium size like animatronic kind of figures but they weren't animatronics um that you could kind of put like outside your door that were really cool there were some skeletons there were some like ghost um there was that thing scarecrow thing from that one movie um but mainly there was just like a lot of cups and stuff uh there wasn't really that many like little things that you could kind of put around the house it was just mainly costumes and that the masks were really cool i really liked those and there was also some really cool shirts um they were a little bit pricey though um they were like 30 dollars um which i guess it's fine but like at the moment it just wasn't reasonable for me um I ended up getting a journal and a pen. There was a couple of really cool little stationary things that I really liked. Um, so yeah, that's what I got. And that was 
my adventure at the spirit store um and it was kind of like my first halloween adventure that i went on um besides just seeing things at like coals and stuff so yeah like i was just really happy to actually go to a halloween store and i hope that this is the first of many halloween vlogs to come i know it's pretty short but um i had a lot of fun like i said and I hope that you guys get some ideas and it puts you in the Halloween spirit seeing this. And I look forward to just doing more Halloween content for you guys because it is the season. It is the spooky season. And I do not care that it is still August. The Halloween stores are open and we're going and we're exploring and we're doing all the things. The fact that I have the self-control to only leave there with a journal and a pen amazes me. I wanted absolutely everything, but I was like being reasonable. Um, 